Washington. It was a parade with a purpose as several hundred students, staff, and alumni from Davis High School strolled throughout the community surrounding their school on October 22nd. Hopefully everybody will go out and vote. Early voting starts today and that's the reason for why this parade. We organize this because it's good for the community. Not only should we educate our students, but we should educate the community and educating the community in early voting is very important. It's a right and they need to understand what a right is. And we're modeling this every day and we're teaching it as well. And now with this kind of exhibition, now that they know how important it is. The parade had a special meeting for several Davis students who celebrated a major milestone, their first trip to the ballot box. Woo! I'm too thrilled about it. I get to change the world with my one vote. We have a vote and we have a say in who we want to be to our use president. Our voice. In addition to making a presidential selection, the first time voters made their decision on several bond issues, including the HISD bond, which would rebuild high schools across the district, including Davis. It is important because our school has been there for a long time and it needs to be rebuilt. So Davis isn't the only high school doing their part to get out the vote and inform voters about the HISD bond. On October 20th, both the young and old gathered at Fur High School for a political rally. So this election is extraordinarily important. We've got the Fur community that's here rallying, getting the students, the parents, the grandparents, the family, the friends and relatives to talk about the importance of voting. It's so important to us because if in fact uh, the bond election passes, Fur will get a new school. And we're not saying vote for it, we're just saying vote early and go to the end of the ballot because we're the last thing on the, on the ballot. And if you vote a straight ticket, then you're going to miss us. Early voting lasts until November 2nd. You can find a list of voting locations at HoustonISD.org as well as more information on the HISD schools bond.